Hi, I'm Dr. Stacy Grossbaum. I'm an orthopedic surgeon from Louisville, Kentucky. I'm going to talk today a little bit about what is a bone spur. The question I get asked me almost every day of the week. So this is an x-ray of a knee. It's called a lateral film and we're going to pan in on this x-ray. Um, this is the kneecap. This is the femur, also known as the thigh bone. This is the tibia, also known as the shin bone. And there are no bone spurs on this x-ray. This x-ray is a patient who has a lot of bone spurs. So if you compare this patella to this patella, you can see this is a bone spur here. These are large bone spurs in this area. Um, there's a bone spur coming off the back of this femur bone, and there's some bone spurs coming off the front of the tibia. So what is a bone spur? Well, a bone spur is an area of growth when you have osteoarthritis. And I get patients that ask me, well, I have a bone spur, can you just go in there and resect and remove the bone spur and then my arthritis is gone? No, bone spurs occur because you have arthritis and arthritis is loss of cartilage in the knee joint. So what we think why bone spurs occur, also known as osteophytes, it's the body's way of trying to reduce the motion of an arthritic joint because if you have arthritis moving the joint can cause pain so by forming all these bone spurs it kind of limits the motion of the joint um, we think that's the body's response we don't really know why we form bone spurs but we think that's the theory behind it so a bone spur is a growth of bone that you get when you have osteoarthritis. And just by removing the bone spurs will not take away the arthritis because arthritis is loss of cartilage.